of the biggest reasons why people don't get much better at chipping and it plagues their game is because they adhere to the three biggest mistakes that we see all the time. So why not find out what those mistakes are and find out how to fix them. So big mistake number one, leaning the handle too much forward. What does it do? It gets the leading edge involved, takes away your loft. So the setup, really big, wide stance, too much for, for what we need. But that big mistake number one, leaning the handle forward. So as you can see, leaning it forward, taking the loft of the club down, and it starts to get the leading edge of the club active. It makes your strike require a lot of precision. Number two, position of the ball. Good old fashioned, get it back in your stance. Well, when you're leaning the handle forward, now you're leaning it further forward. So what are you doing? You're taking away more loft again, making it even more difficult to control the shot and the trajectory that you're going to hit the ball on. Um, sometimes I even see the ball go back out here, believe it or not. Um, Call all that lean. Number three, the one that compounds, one and two, hit down. Hit down, what does hitting down do? Leaning forward, ball back in your stance, hit down, leads a lot of that. And you can see how the club just completely stops as you come through. So what does that force some people to do? Oh, hit down and scoop, because we don't want to hit the ground too soon. So when we put all those mistakes together, what does the bad shot look like? Something like that. So we know what the mistakes are. How do we fix it? Okay, key principles. <clears throat> Number one, narrow stance. This makes it easy to lean a little bit of pressure onto the lead leg, keeping it there without feeling like you're gonna lean over. Number two, ball position right in the middle of the stance. From this setup position, we can keep the shaft more upright and less leaning. Number three, we don't wanna get wristy. We don't wanna hit down. We wanna let the arms move back and as the center of the chest turns to face the target the club is moving down the circle so it's moving in a nice shallow angle it's still moving downward but we're not hitting down we're just moving down the bottom of a circle and we're using the bounce the bounce the club is going to glide along the floor for about four inches so there's no precision required in the shot you've just got to make sure that the golf club brushes the ground if it brushes the ground it's going to collect the ball if it doesn't brush the ground you're going to miss it you're going to thin it you're going to top it so we've got to make sure that we brush the ground okay how does that look so narrow stance with the wedge pushing into your lead foot a little bit more shaft is more up not leaning forward Arms go back, chest turns. Then we get the good quality strike. We get the control, we get the ball going up the club face. The grooves create that spin. So from now on, stop making those big mistakes. Simplify it, get the body involved and let the bounce of the club do all the work for you. Guys, thanks for watching. If you like it, give it a thumbs up, share it around with your friends to make sure that they stop making those three big mistakes when it comes to their chipping. And from that point, we'll all start playing better golf. Thanks for watching.